Good morning, third grade. It is time for Wednesday Social Studies. Yesterday in section one and two, well in section one we learned why immigrants come to the United States and in section two we learned how they come to the United States. Today in section three we'll be talking about settling in the United States and in section four we'll be talking about life for immigrants in the, in the United States. We'll start off on page 62. Settling in the United States. People from all over the world have immigrated to the United States, but they did not all come to the same, come at the same time, and they did not all settle in the same place. About 170 years ago, many immig immigrants came to the United States from Ireland Germ in Germany. They crossed the Atlantic Ocean and arrived on the east coast of the United States. There were a lot of jobs available in the northeastern cities and the Irish tended to settle, settle in the cities such as New York City, Boston, and Philadelphia. Germans, who usually had more money than the Irish, often moved west and became farmers. After the Irish and the Germans first came, an even greater wave of immigrants arrived. This time, most of the immigrants were coming from southern and the eastern Europe. The bottom is a picture. Just what? It's crowded. A lot of people in the street. Looks like they're shopping. It's like a market. Page 63. It's more of the city scene. Immigrants from the same country often settled in the same neighborhoods. Italians found work in New York City where they settled on neighborhoods called Little Italy's. Jewish immigrants flocked to the lower east side of New York City where many made clothes for a living, Chinese immigrants crossed the Pacific Ocean and arrived on the West Coast. They came to California seeking gold. They often settled in neighborhoods like Chinatown and San Francisco. A little over a century ago, many Mexicans immigrated to California and the Southwest. Many worked on farms or railroads. Today, most immigrants come from Asia and Latin America. Are there immigrants living in your community? Where are they from? Life for immigrants in the United States. Many immigrants come to the United States for a better future, but starting life in a new country can be hard. Sometimes people discriminate against immigrants. The discriminate to discriminate means to treat people unfairly because they belong to a different group. When groups of immigrants first arrived, they needed jobs and housing, but many hospitals did not hire Jewish doctors and housing was closed for Chinese immigrants in many years. Many Italians were treated like criminals because a few Italians had become famous criminals. And Mexican immigrants were paid very low wages. Immigrants today face challenges too. Some immigrants have taken jobs that no one else wants. These jobs can be dangerous. Often, they don't pay much money. Many immigrants work long hours to earn money that they need. Immigrants also find good jobs about their about life here. They may have more freedom than they had before. If they work hard, they may get better jobs. Then their children can have better lives in the United States. Some immigrants are famous in our country. Albert Einstein, an award-winning scientist, came here from Germany. Einstein was a Jew and at, and at the time, Germany was da a dangerous place for Jews to live. He came to our country for protection. Eileen Rose Latina is a member of the U.S. House of Representatives. She came from Cuba in 1989. She became the first Latina elected to Congress. A picture. You barely made it. I'm happy it wasn't my face.
face in there and it was a screen recording. Sorry. Needed to do it. She already I did, did it. it. Such a tool. Sorry, 